Welcome to the ProPAC MD ECG Monitoring Module. The ProPAC offers the only diagnostic display of up to four different ECG waveforms. The ProPAC unit can be used to monitor the electrocardiogram. 12-lead ECG monitoring is also available, which provides simultaneous acquisition and storage of 12-lead information. The device is capable of monitoring all 12 leads and a 12-lead snapshot. Resting ECG is easily acquired. The ProPAC MD can monitor the electrocardiogram with the following configurations. 3-lead, 4-lead, 5-lead, or 12-lead. The device was created to allow it also to be backwards compatible with ECG cables used with previous versions of ProPAC monitors. Connect the 12-lead ECG cable to the ECG input connector on the left side of the unit. To access lead ECG setup and monitoring, you will need to press the lead quick access key. Pressing the Lead Select Quick Access key will allow you to toggle through all available ECG leads for primary monitoring lead. Use the navigation keys to highlight the lead indicator for any monitoring lead and press the Select key. A drop-down box will appear, giving the provider a list of all available options for monitoring functions. This option also provides for the ability to insert cascade or remove tracings to customize the display. You can fit up to four waveforms on the ProPAC display. The first waveform at the top of the display is always an ECG waveform. In the following example, lead 2, RALL, is the source of the ECG waveform trace. To change the lead size using the navigation keys, Highlight the size indicator of any parameter and hit the select button. A drop-down box will appear showing all of the size options available. Scroll up or down using the navigation keys and use the select button to select desired option. The default trace size is 1 cm per millivolt. You can select a larger or smaller trace size. You can also specify that the ProPAC MD select a best fit trace size by pressing Auto. The ProPAC MD displays the patient's respiration in the respiration breathe rate meter. The respiration rate is derived by default from the unit's CO2 monitoring function. If CO2 monitoring is not available, the unit derives the respiration rate through impedance pneumography using a specified ECG electrode configuration. If ECG monitoring isn't functioning, the meter will not display a respiration rate. The ProPAC MD allows you to enable and disable the respiration rate alarm, to set alarm limits, and to specify the ECG monitoring source for the respiration rate. To configure alarms through the respiration parameter control panel, use the navigation keys to highlight and select the respiration rate meter and display the respiration parameter control panel. The heart rate meter displays the heart rate that it derives from the ECG monitoring function by default or from a monitoring function that you specify, such as SpO2. The ProPAC MD allows you to enable and disable the heart rate HR alarm, to set alarm limits, and to select a heart rate tone. To configure alarms through the heart rate parameter control panel, use the navigation keys to highlight and select the heart rate meter and display the HRPR parameter control panel. In order to get a display of all 12 leads at once, press the 12 lead quick access key. This view provides the user with a complete cardiac picture of the patient. The user is also able to easily identify artifact and poor lead contact. By pressing the 12 lead acquire quick access key, 
the ProPack MD unit displays the Acquiring 12 Lead status bar as it collects 10 seconds of 12 lead ECG data. After you have acquired the snapshot, you now have a split screen as a result of the 12 lead acquisition. On the left is a series of six windows that mirror what your 12 lead printout looks like. The first page is your interpretive statement, or the results of the analysis. On the right, you'll notice that there is a dynamic ECG, so you can continue to monitor your patient. You'll notice the scroll key, the second button down, which you can use to scroll through various pages, and on page 2, there is patient demographic information, as well as global measurement. As we scroll through, we can see the various pages on the ECG, which allows you to select from four consecutively acquired 12 leads and choose the best quality tracing. This will give you a full look without printing unnecessary paper strips. After the snapshot key, the patient info icon appears as a clipboard with a chart attached. The patient's age and gender are the most important fields. The 12 lead interpretive algorithm will alter interpretation based on age and gender variables. If you do not enter a patient age and gender, the ProPAC will, by default, assume you are treating a 45-year-old male patient and adopt its diagnostic finding for this patient type. For more information on the 12 lead transmissions, please see the Operator's Manual. You have reached the end of the ProPAC MD ECG monitoring module. For details on other capabilities of the ProPAC MD, please review those separate modules.